Off camera, because I didn't use the usual tape method, I overshot the depth of this high E string. So I took out some uh, glue, I'll show you that in a second, and filled in the slot. I overfilled the slot on purpose because I know I can refile it. Hello, and thank you for watching Guitar How To's. This is the product I used to refill the slot. I used a toothpick because I didn't want it to just pour out quickly out of the applicator. I laid tape down on each side of the nut to capture any runoff. Now I'll move the strings aside, put down my layers of tape as I've shown on other videos, and refile that slot. Here's my 14 layers of tape. I measured that against the first fret before I slipped it over to the nut and we want the tape uh, level to be just slightly above the first fret. So to not scratch the wood above the nut, I put two layers of tape down. And let's get to work. Little strokes to get started, just like cutting a piece of wood. Now stop, there's white showing here, that's plastic. In this case it's plastic because the nut's plastic obviously. So I want to stop there. It's hitting the tape now, so we're done. My suggestion is use something soft to, you know, clear away some unwanted, shall we, shall we say debris, might be a big word for this job. Uh, do not use a screwdriver. Toothpicks work really good. Now we're ready to string it up, tune it up, and see how that slot now feels. While here, I took the liberty of lubricating all the nut slots and lubricating or re-lubricating, really in my case, uh, underneath the uh, string trees. And I did that with, as you can see, with petroleum jelly. Here is our end result. Very nice. Now, you'll know I'll take a toothpick and get that. It's petroleum jelly that's right underneath the E-string there. I'll just put a point of a tooth, tooth, uh, toothpick in there and get that out. But, as you can see, it's clearing. It's clearing both the left side of the neck and it's clearing the first fret and let's just take a look let's check for buzzes here just on the open strings whoops oh really good all right so that's how you do it by the way i forgot to mention one thing yeah, after putting the glue in the slot, I let this sit for about 12 hours just to make sure that that glue was hard. Hopefully you can see this, this little shiny spot here. That's remnants of glue. Uh, and a couple of swipes with an emery board will take care of that. 